Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make a great night, folks. Don't take anything personal. Your truth is personal to you. Your own opinions and point of view reflect your own agreements and are personal to you. It's no one's truth but your own. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 725, NASDAQ's up 325, SP's up 100, gold. Gold contract trading up uh, $31.90, 1734 an ounce. We have silver up 52 cents, 21 dollars 11 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up 283, trading out of price point 86.45. Notes and bonds. You get the 10 year note up nine ticks right now, trading at a price point of 113.15. The 30 year up 11 at 120. 2821. The 10 year folks is yielding 3.617 in King Dollar. King Dollar down a 1,554 ticks, trading 110, 187. The euro is at 99. The yen is out here at a price point of 144, and the British pound is at 114 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877 927 6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world and the world of the SPs? Let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, well, first, let's bring up the, we'll bring up the E-minis first. So we bring up the E-minis. You've only got one retracement all day. It's been an up market in a big way. Uh, bump. We take a look at this. What you're going to see, however, is that, that when we came down, that's going to be a high volume low. So my take is coming into the close. We're going to go after this high volume low again, which is the 37.66. Uh, which is only 30 points down the S&P, which is not a big deal on a volatile day. If we take a look at this now, that's the, S the, the futures. If we go into the SPY, what you're looking at in the SPY is that, you know, you've got a great day going, no doubt. Up $9.72. You're coming into the downdraft of the uh, 21st. Now, that's 106 million shares. So bottom line, we're, we're not going to do 106 million shares. That's the real bottom line. The question is going to be, you know, what do you do? And... It's the NDX that actually has given us more information. The reason I'm saying that is this. See, we don't have a swing here. You know, we have the lows of the downdraft. Now, it's, it has come into the lows of the downdraft. The real question is, if that's going to fail here, you'd have to really back off two or three points on the SPY. We'll see where that shakes out. That being said, my take is that you're going to see that failure come in the queues. The queues are totally different, man. It's a different setup also. And what it is, is that the, the setup on the queues, see, is that we got over the high that was generated just last week. That high was 281.25. We made it to 282.85. We have 79 million shares there. Now, we're at 50, so you could do 79 million. I will see if that shakes out. But if you close under that, that is saying it's a you know, one day wonder on your hands here. So if we don't close under it, it will basically go up to ice. Ice is uh, 285.62. And if I bring this back again for a second, you can see how this is set up. I think I'll do the futures first so you can see the futures. The futures are right at a 0.38. Well, it went up to a 0.382. Uh, do it this way. There we go. So if you take this, uh, just the last leg down, I'll open this up for you. But you can see it's a beauty, man. It's, well, actually, well, 3807, look at this. So 3807 is the 0.618. It went to 3802. Now, and this is where you can tell that the, the, the futures and the NDX 100 still a weaker. This, is, this has been like a, a classic, uh, you know, example of markets and weakness inside markets. And you can see that on the NQs, 11,702 is the number, and we only made 11,675. So this is going to be pretty cool watching this whole thing shake out. Gold. We went to the gold contract. What do you have with the gold contract? Bottom line, uh, it has price, it has volume. Uh, inside the gold contract right now, we've done uh, 193,000 contracts. Let's see what we're coming into here. Okay, so. Oh, that's interesting. We need more volume there, too. 
Well, we're down 228. So I still want more volume there. We're going to close it. Well, we should close it over on price. The 1696 is the number, and we're way over that. We're, we're over that by $35 right now. And King Dollar. So if we go to King Dollar and take a look at King Dollar, it looks to me King Dollar, bottom line, coming down hard and fast. Uh, you, the, well, you, you get two different things. As we broke topside, we broke topside at 110, 132. We hit 110.055, we're at 110.218, you know, and the highs of one of the big signs of strength, which was generated out here when it rejected lower price on the 13th is 110.011, um, you know, so we went to 105, the, doesn't, the, you know, this, I think, I suspect you're going to get a little sign of support here. This is a hard move down, though, there's no doubt about that. In the dollar, hard move down, giving the market some, uh, market some time to breathe. Uh, we'll see where the whole thing shakes out as we get into the close. If we take a look at the strength inside the NDX 100, you have Illumina is up 9%. You got Lucent up uh, 8.3. Um, you got uh, ASML up 6.7. Uh, only one's negative in the NDX 100, Netflix uh, and uh, Dollar Store. Inside the Dow Industrial, strength versus the weakness inside the Dow. We take a look at that. And I suspect, look at this, they actually do have, Coca-Cola is the only one that's negative. Uh, putting strength into a Goldman, 89 positive points, Caterpillar 53, Microsoft 48, Boeing 39. You know, so the bottom line is that uh, how we close, um, you know, is the bottom line will say that, okay, are you going to continue higher? Uh, because if we look at, the, I believe what we're going to see is, let me see if we can have a contraction. Yesterday we did 1.1. It's close. We're at 655. We can do 1.1. 1 .1. Uh, and, we, and on the composite, 4.3. We'll we'll do we'll do we'll do we'll do an expansion of volume today. That's what that's what it looks like right now. Dow Dow Industrials uh, up 681. Nasdaq is up 310. S&P's up 96. There, right there, folks. Come right back.